Hello! Welcome back to Mina's Daily Dose. My name is Mina. Thank you for joining me today. And if you are new, thank you for clicking on this video. And if you are already part of the fam, hello. How are you? Thank you for your continued support. Today I am working from home. So if you see me keep, if I keep looking back, I have my work laptop here. So I am just getting ready because I need to go get my nails done. I mean, goodness y'all. I had acrylics on and they broke off. I think she did them too thin. So I'm just gonna go either get an overlay or I'm gonna just, or I'm gonna get a gel manicure. And I think I'm leaning more towards a gel manicure. <sighs> so yeah, and I'm gonna get my feet done. But let's go ahead and get started. I planned on priming and prepping my skin before I started this video, but obviously that didn't work. So I'm going to be using my, Let's try that again. So I'm going to be using my rose water and I've been using this lately a lot and I really do like it. And I'm just using it to moisturize my skin. And then I'm going over that with my Smashbox primer water. And so I'm really not trying to do much because all I'm doing is getting my nails done and I just want my face to look, you know, I just wanna be a little cute, okay? I just wanna be a little cute today. I'm going to use my Maybelline Matte Poreless Foundation. And because this is too light, I'm going to add my Cover FX Drops. I'm going for just like an even tone look. I am try not trying to be beat to the gods, okay? Literally, that is how much I have. I'm gonna add like two and a half drops of the Cover FX brush that I've been loving lately is this Real Techniques Deluxe Face Brush. So I'm just going to use a light hand to just buff that into the skin. And you guys, it's not that this is too light for my skin. I have, you know, hyperpigmentation and things like that on my face and so once everything is blended out it's like perfect and then also I'm sitting in front of a window and so sometimes it shows up a little bit lighter which I just don't know why it does that but it should oxidize a little bit and I'm going to go ahead and do my brows and I'm going to speed through this because I feel like sometimes brows can be boring I am using a kiss New York brow pencil I believe so far I've used this in like every single tutorial. HD concealer and this is in cappuccino and we are going to bronze okay I want to look like I have been in the sun for like three weeks straight you know what I'm saying so I hope everybody is doing well and I hope everyone is still enjoying their summer even though it is winding down it is winding down quick honey real quick and my summer really wasn't a summer because i was taking a goddamn class okay so your girl was super busy
So I'm going to lightly set everything. I'm not really going to go crazy, but I'm going to go into my Kat Von D and I'm going to go in this powder right here. I'm going to, oh shoot, I'm going to set my under eyes. And I'm mainly going to set the inner area of my eye, under eye. Because I feel like I have, I would have more build up here. And this is a deluxe concealer brush. And I'm really loving this by Real Techniques as well. I'm just going to focus that color. I'm just gonna set down the middle of my nose as well. Now it's time to set the contour, honey, and we're going back into that Kat Von D shade and light palette. And I'm going to use the middle one only. It's gonna be giving me a nice light contour. It's not going to do too much. It's literally just going to set that concealer that I used. This is a very cool toned powder. And you guys, you guys have been knowing that for some reason I've been loving blush. I don't know what it is, but I've just been loving blush lately. I just like how it looks. So because I'm going with a fresh look, I definitely want to use a blush. I am using this pink blush right here. And this is Flower Power by MAC. It is elderly, okay? I've had this for a very long time, but we don't waste money right here, okay? We don't waste money. And I'm gonna kind of bring it up a little bit. That's cute. Okay, I'm going to highlight with, we already know what I'm highlighting with. I don't even have to go over it. For the lashes, I'm just going to lightly coat it with some mascara. I'm really not trying to do too much here because I've really been hating taking off mascara on my eyes. I don't know what the issue is, but it never works out. I mean, y'all, I can use oil. I can use whatever, okay? It's not working. It just doesn't want to come off. For my lips, I'm just going to be using a good old lip gloss, okay? Nothing too much. I just want my lips to be moisturized. That is the completed look, a really quick, fresh look that you can just throw on just to go out, just when you want to look, you know, real cute and glowy and put together. Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this really quick easy fresh makeup tutorial oh and how about this click that subscribe button boo join the mdd family we are small it is okay we are here we're here together okay smooches booze and i'll see you guys on my next video 